maybe allowing yourself to just begin to take a few breaths <clears throat> to just begin arriving, tapping in towards that parasympathetic nervous system, our rest and digest state. It's so easy to get snapped out of that in the morning. We wake up, we have a million things on our mind, especially on a Monday. So just taking some deep breaths, allowing ourselves to come back into our bodies. Start to notice how you feel this morning. And if you're able to, inhaling through the nose and exhaling through the mouth really helps to activate that parasympathetic nervous system. If you feel called to just a tiny little bit of movement before we settle in, feel free. You can roll your shoulders. Today we're going to be just checking in as we usually do, mind, breath, heart. And then kind of dropping in, uh, I'll invite you to just sit with your emotions, whatever you're feeling today. Uh, this feels particularly good for when you are feeling challenged. And there's a lot of challenges <laughs> in the world right now, right? But also just anything that you may have going on in your personal life and anxiety, excitement, like anything that you're feeling, that's what I'm inviting you to bring in today. And that's what meditation is really is learning to be able to sit with these emotions and to accept who we are and the fullness of our being so that we can learn more about ourselves, realize that we are strong and capable and what what gift it is to feel emotion as a human being. All right, so go ahead and begin to shut down the eyes or bring the gaze soft and in front of you. You can gently press up through the crown of the head, lengthening the back of the neck, allowing the shoulders to just relax, maybe even shrug them a couple times. Beginning to relax the face. And continuing with these breaths in through the nose if you're able and out through the mouth. If you're not able, whatever you're comfortable with. And inviting the belly to relax through these breaths. On the inhale, everything is expanding and relaxing. And on the exhales, we push that air out. We have a very gentle contraction happening in the body. Belly button finds its way towards the low spine. We're just grounding into our practice. Thank you for joining. And since we started at the crown of the head, we're coming down through that softness of the face, checking in with the jaw, seeing if the tongue can relax away from the top of the mouth. Maybe the jaw even separates slightly. And oftentimes this can encourage a cascade effect coming down through the throat, through the heart, just a relaxation for the rest of the body. See if that's possible for you this morning. Or maybe just noticing where you're holding any tension. Again, just bringing that awareness. There's no right or wrong about it. Just simply how you're feeling this morning. I'll give us just a few breaths here to just notice. I'm noticing that my hips and low back are a little sore, so just wobbling side to side a little bit kind of helps with that. You don't have to sit completely still. This is your practice. And then we'll slowly start to notice how the mind is this morning. The mind rhythm, does it have a lot to say? to think of, to remind you of this morning. Or with each of these inhales through the nose, out through the mouth, can you invite your mind to rest on the breath, to be here in the present moment with you as you're breathing? 
I'll give us a few breaths to just notice here. Really lengthening out those breaths. And maybe you notice that the mind is reminding you of all these things you have to do in your day, your week, maybe some things that happened this weekend. And that's fine too. We can just notice what's coming up. And to the best of our ability, when we notice, taking another breath and inviting the mind back onto the breath to rest here. And that is essentially, that can essentially be the meditation practice. Just constantly noticing the mind, taking a breath and bringing it back. So simple and not exactly easy. Just notice how it feels for you this morning. And then tying that back in with that full body scan, just checking in between breaths. Are you still relaxing? Is there anything that you can encourage to release or to loosen up? Noticing where the arms and the hands feel most comfortable today. If you want to bring one hand to the belly, one hand to the heart, I invite you to do that. Everything's always optional. Beginning to really feel the breath here in the body. If you feel called at all, you could even let out a little hum through your exhale or a sigh. Ah. Oh. Feel free to do that as many times as feels comfortable for you. This is another way to drop just slightly deeper into this parasympathetic nervous system. You're also reminding yourself that you're here for you. And it gives you an opportunity to feel the way that your voice reverberates within your body. Helping you remember that your voice does matter. First and foremost, it matters to you. And then it matters how we use it with others. Just breathing into this space. Noticing what the mind may have to say about it. Inviting that breath back. If you're able, through your inhale, really feeling that relaxation through the belly, coming up through the ribs and into the heart space, maybe pausing at the top. And then that exhale comes down through the heart space, through the ribs and out the belly, feeling that belly button gently coming in towards the low spine on the exhale. And just moving with this rhythm for a few rounds, if it's comfortable for you, inhaling, softening through the belly, the ribs, the chest, if possible, pausing at the top for a moment. And complete exhale through that chest space, down through the ribs and out the belly. Give us a few moments of silence just to be with these rhythms in our own bodies.
Noticing again any tension that may arise. Sometimes when I'm taking deep breaths, I find that my shoulders and my muscles start to clench a little bit. We're encouraging this softness, this relaxation. Perhaps if you're finding a little tension in the breath, just maybe not going as deep or big with the breath. Just noticing your own edges here. And gently moving from the breath, beginning to notice the heart rhythm. Can you feel your pulse or just the sensation of your heart beating in your body? Just as the breath and the mind have their own rhythms, so does the heart. And all these rhythms are dancing, constantly intertwined. Sometimes tripping each other up. This is an opportunity to just recalibrate, to notice, to be with yourself. And for the next few minutes, I invite you to silently ask yourself and sit with, how are you feeling this morning? Breathing into that space, really allowing yourself to truly, honestly answer with you. You're not answering for me or anyone else. This is just for you. If I'm being honest this morning, I'm sitting with a little bit of guilt, a little bit of shame. Whatever you may be feeling with, continue to breathe. Notice how the mind wants to interact. You can continue to take a breath. Invite that mind to just rest on the breath. And allow yourself to just notice any sensations in the body. If you have any anxiety or nervous energy or that excitement energy, just noticing where that where you feel that in the body that usually originates from kind of like the belly but again we are individual people just noticing where it anything is for you may not look the same as anyone else and that is perfectly great because you are you breathing into that remembering despite how you feel that you are here for yourself, that you are learning, you are growing. You are cultivating a trust within your own being. Folding back through that body scan, gently pressing up through the crown of the head, relaxing the face, the shoulders, the belly, the feet. Just a few more breaths here, just being with the body any sensations, any emotion, whatever you're sitting with.
being gentle with yourself. Noticing the mind again, taking another breath. And I'll invite you to start calling on gratitude. When I had a teacher that asked me to do that for the first time, it felt very complicated, very elusive. So just first noticing with yourself, what does gratitude mean for you? Who or what makes you grateful? Just thinking of these things. See if you can cultivate the sensation of gratitude within your own body. Perhaps it's possible this morning, perhaps not. Just noticing it's just an intention. Perhaps thinking on people, places, or things that your life just wouldn't be the same without. And if possible, I invite you to strive to cultivate just a little bit of gratitude towards yourself. Knowing how hard it is to create this time for yourself. We live in a very fast paced world that is constantly drawing you outside of yourself. Can you feel grateful for slowing down? Grateful for tuning in to know who you are and how you want to show up in the world? Grateful for creating space to give yourself that opportunity? Grateful to know that it is a practice that must be cultivated and you are here. Continuing to breathe, just noticing what's coming up, how you're feeling. If you feel comfortable, I invite you to join me for just a couple of deep breaths to end the practice, taking a nice deep inhale, really feeling this heart space lifting. And through the exhale, pressing through the crown of the head as you feel that breath coming down out through the belly. Relaxing everything, nice big inhale, lifting the heart, softening the body. Gentle exhale, pressing through the crown of the head, letting that breath come down through the chest, ribs, belly. Last full inhale, nice big breath in. Lifting the heart space and full exhale. We'll close out our practice with a nice big inhale up today, reaching up, maybe stretching, lifting the gaze, hands come together, exhaling down to our third eye center for a moment. Pausing here for a moment to just remember this innate intelligence within us, these systems that are constantly working beyond our logical knowing. Just taking a moment to honor that. We'll move the fingers to the chin, allowing them to bloom open, creating a space between the palms. This is a symbol for love and light. Just sharing this between each other. Thank you for being here and creating this atmosphere with me, for tapping into this community. May we remember that we are each teachers and we are each students. Gently closing the fingers, I invite you to bring your hands over your own heart, possibly even bowing this left temple towards the heart space. Breathing here for a moment, I invite you to just silently again thank yourself sincerely 
for showing up this morning. And as you're ready, bringing those hands down to the lap or the knees, just taking a couple more breaths here, feeling into this parasympathetic nervous system for a few more moments before we go on with our days. Please remember that you have this calm, centered space inside of you. And when you take the time to be in that calm and centered space within yourself, and I take the time to be in that calm and centered space within myself, we begin to share this oneness, this unity, and we know where our strength resides. I honor that space within each and every one of you. Thank you so much for being here with me this morning. This was really special.